Hello, Crypto Novus, and welcome back. My name is Chris Brown, and I am the host of the channel. Today, we are going to talk about the city of Miami and what they are doing in the world of cryptocurrency today. As you can see, the listing that I have on Google here is Miami City Coin. And over the past three days, uh, there's been a lot of reports, as you can see here, of the Miami Coin, which is the first digital asset that has been created by a municipality. And Miami has already placed itself on the map in terms of being a center for Bitcoin with hosting the Bitcoin conference uh, back in July um, and doing that on an annual basis. So before I get into the details, why don't we take a listen to the mayor himself of the city of Miami and let uh, him share his thoughts on why this coin was created and what his hopes are in terms of what it could possibly accomplish for the city of Miami and for its residents. I wish I was smart enough to create something like this. This is actually the creation of Apology uh, from Coinbase, uh, formerly from Coinbase. But no, uh, what the city gets out of it is a percentage of the coins that are mined are actually donated to the city of Miami by and the virtue of its protocol. So the city of Miami could end up earning millions of dollars uh, as a result of the popularity of, of Miami coin, uh, because obviously Miami has now become, and we've talked about this many times on your program, the Bitcoin capital of the world. And we're focusing on differentiating our economy by creating the new wave of technological products uh, that will incentivize people to move to Miami and be part of our tech ecosystem. Well, what will the Miami coin actually be used for? Well, it's, it's like a Bitcoin and it's on the Stacks uh, blockchain protocol. So whenever uh, that coin is mined, a percentage of the coin by virtue of the programming goes to the city of Miami. It's actually 30% of what's mined. 70% will actually go to the miners. So what happens is Miami will benefit uh, from the use of the Miami coin and from the branding that is associated with it. Um, and then that will go directly into our general fund. So we can use that to continue to alleviate homelessness. We're, we're you know, we're a big city that's trying to eliminate homelessness completely. And um, we can focus on obviously policing and increasing our police force, which is something that we've done. And we can focus on a variety of other things that our city does very, very well um, and to increase our quality of life for our residents. That was very interesting in terms of what the mayor had to say and his hopes of it being able to generate some revenue so that the city can obviously provide the services uh, that any municipality needs, and in particular in the city of Miami. So let's take a look at what's happening in the Magic City, as they're in it, as it is also called, and to take a closer look as to what's happening with uh, the Miami coin. So first off, as mentioned before, it is in fact the first municipality that has created a digital asset. And as the mayor has indicated, the city has partnered with a company called City Coin, and City Coin is a cryptocurrency is a cryptocurrency team which facilitates the launch of digital assets to support municipalities. And Miami, of course, is their first. We'll take a look, closer look at CityCoin's website and see what else they may have in store for us in the future. So the question is, we you know what, what is Miami Coin? It's a digital currency. The question is then, you know, how do you get a hold of it and how exactly does it work? So as the mayor has indicated, you know, 30% of the revenue generated from the Miami coin will be forwarded to a wallet that's reserved just for the city of Miami and the city treasury. Uh, this concept of splitting proceeds isn't new. SafeMoon did it a, a while ago when it was launched. Um, Miami coin is launched to benefit the financial health of Miami. And so if Miami has a special place in your heart because you live there or you're from there, or you loved visiting there and you want to support what's happening with the city, then of course, this is one way that you can actually invest in the cryptocurrency market as well as support uh, the city of Miami. It's a social coin essentially. And these types of coins are going to become popular in the next two, three years as the cryptocurrency uh, market begins to, not begins, continues to expand and adoption increases. So how do you buy Miami coin is the question um, and the title of this video, of course. And you really don't buy Miami coin itself. What you have to do is you have to mine it. And so kind of let's look at the, some of the details as to how that exactly works. Miami coin is powered by Stacks. And Stacks is a protocol that, enable, that works off of smart contracts that enables people to build on the, the Bitcoin network. Uh, 
an example of this would be similar to what happens with Ethereum, with NFTs, or you know, building ERC tokens. So uh, typically, for those of you that may not know, typical mining incurs a lot of complex hardware and the solving of crypto cryptographic equations. Uh, in this case, that's not exactly what you have to do. The Miami coin is a little bit different than other coins. According to the Miami, uh, the city coin itself, the, there's no hardware requirements for mining Miami coin. Basically, all you need to do is you need to basically transfer STX or Stacks tokens into the Miami coin smart contract. Uh, the example that's given here is, is, like I said, is similar to what happens when you uh, buy NFTs and build on the Ethereum blockchain itself. So um, there are some additional benefits to uh, be involved with Stacks, which I won't get all into that at this at this conjuncture. But what I want to do is let's take a look at the City Coin website and see what they have to say and what additional information you can get from that location, which I highly recommend you going to. So here's the CityCoin website. This is obviously the page for Miami Coin, and there's some really good information here. Here's obviously the, uh, the, the advertising for what Miami Coin actually is, but what's really key is how this works. And so if you come down and you scroll down and you come to this location, you can obviously see that Miami Coin is, stack, is powered by Stacks, built on the blockchain network, um, and that you forward SDC tokens through the protocol. See here, 30% of the miners, the miners forwarded STX is directed towards a wallet that's reserved for Miami. And then the remaining 70% of what you do is then yielded in STX or BTC. If you want to learn more about this, you're then taken to this page, which gives you a lot more information and detail about how this works, as well as some frequently asked questions about, you know, why Miami? And basically, the reason why they chose Miami to start is Miami has been a long center for culture and innovation in the United States, and has definitely has made its play in the blockchain world by hosting that large convention that we're all in the that we all are aware of at this point. Um, basically, it says here that Miami Treasury, basically Miami Treasury, can, the Treasury consists of STX, which is then sent to miners, which is then forward and funds to the Stack Smart Contract uh, for the right to compete for mining competition. And so, you know, for those of you that want additional information, I would definitely come here, click on to these you know, read more categories and so that you can learn more about Miami Coin. And for, for this one, how do you get Miami Coin? And then you can kind of read this real quickly. Um, as I had mentioned before, oh, but, well, before I get into that, I want to sh share a little bit with who is City Coins. Here is their team. Basically, they were started by uh, Patrick Stanley. He is the creator uh, and the head of growth at Stacks. He studied economics at John Hopkins, um, and he's been in the startup world since 2017. He's partnered with Kristen Wagner and with Jason Schrader. But as I had mentioned, there's more in store. Miami Coin is just the first. So if we click here to see cities, we will find out that San Francisco is the next one that's slated to have its own coin as well. So we'll look forward to seeing what's going to happen with that. I will keep track of it. And of course, I will report it to the community to let you guys know in, in the case that you might be interested in the good old city of San Francisco. Um, that's it for today. Uh, again, this is Crypto Novus, where newbies become masters. My name is Chris Brown, the host, and I look forward to seeing you guys in the next video.